through our evolution here at Ringwood Farms, we have um, expanded a lot of acreage, and then we kind of reached where we were um, not being as productive on all the acres, so we downsized a little bit. And then that's allowed us to become more profitable, uh, improve our yields because we can manage a certain amount of acres better. I don't want to be the person that just rides in a pickup. I want to be the person that scouts. I want to plant the crop and also want to harvest the crop. So that's one thing that we've done here. The fertility program, fertigating, I think that contributed a lot. And then we just um, try to maintain our plant health. If somebody wants to start improving upon their yields, um, they got to realize it's it takes time. They it all has to become profitable, so they have to manage their dollar. But just because you buy something cheap doesn't mean you're going to have a bigger profit. Uh, what you got to do is fiscally spend that money and evaluate the inputs that the crop needs. So study the crop, understand what it needs, surround yourself with some an expert. You know, it doesn't have to be a professor at a university. It could just be your local fertilizer dealer. You know, create that relationship. We have an, a, a private agronomist that we work with. I also have some folks in the agribusiness uh, arena that I work with. And then when we're dealing with their uh, Pioneer hybrids, then we deal with Jenny, um, their agronomist team. And then whenever um, we have any specific questions, you know, I just source out those folks. You know, one of the most rewarding compliments you can have is when somebody comes by and asks what's going on or tries to duplicate what you do because that means you've been successful. And, and then if, if I can help somebody else out, you know, that's pretty exciting stuff.